This is Justin Jamino from DragonBlogger.com, and I'm here to show you how to do some basic Bluetooth pairing troubleshooting with Windows 8.1. I noticed that I was having trouble pairing devices with Windows 8.1, so I did some research and found out what the issue was, and I just wanted to share that video with others who may be having similar trouble. So there's multiple services in Windows that work with Bluetooth devices. One of the biggest ones is called the Bluetooth Support Service, which you hear the word support, but that's the one that actually pairs devices. So what you want to do is, if you're having an issue where you're trying to put your Bluetooth device in pairing mode, and you see it's in pairing mode, but Windows doesn't see it, it forever searches, and I'll show you here in the uh, example here that I have here. So say you are trying to do Bluetooth pairing, and you're trying to add a, a Bluetooth device, and Windows won't show you that device at all. Give me a second. It should show up here. So this one's paired, but you see how it's searching for devices constantly, and no other devices are showing up. And they'll infinitely keep searching. It'll never see the device, even though the device is in parry mode. Well, I'll show you what the cause of that was. So what you want to do is you want to open up your services. Uh, just click on your Start button and type Services, or just do a search for Windows Services and open it up. Then what you're going to look for services is look down for where your Bluetooth services are. You can see in the case here, I have my Bluetooth service which is running, and this is the service that handles the installation or removal of Bluetooth devices. But there's also the Bluetooth support service, and you see this one is disabled, and this is why I can't pair devices with Windows 8.1. So you want to just double click on this, set it to automatic so that it always starts when you reboot Windows, and then what you're going to do is just right click on it and start the Bluetooth pairing service, or support service. Now, when you go to Bluetooth pairing in Windows 8.1, you should be able to see any Bluetooth devices that are trying to pair. And we'll go show that right now as well. So we'll go to our Bluetooth icon, and we'll do add a Bluetooth device here. PC and devices, Bluetooth, and I'll set my device into pairing mode here. And I'm actually pairing the Sound Blaster uh, Creative Sound Blaster Evo ZXR right here and then you see it starts showing up but it doesn't really know what it is yet so you gotta give it time to do discovery and fully identify the device it should say uh, Evo ZXR or something like that. there you go SB Evo ZXR click ready to pair pair the device And then it should be installing drivers and what it needs to pair the device and make it work with Windows. And there you go. You've now paired the SoundBlast Evo ZXR, but obviously I've paired the Arctic P614 Bluetooth as well using the same method. Now, this isn't the be-all and end-all of troubleshooting Bluetooth on Windows. What I'm saying is that for some reason I found that this service was disabled in my Windows 8.1 and this could be a similar issue that you have. So check your Windows services. Sometimes you may want to start and restart that service and see if it solves your issue. Just a troubleshooting tip if you're having trouble pairing devices in Windows 8.1. Hopefully it solves your issue too. Thank you for watching.